may have heard, Monday is Earth Day, and the Hotberg Estate is doing what it can to increase the community's commitment to helping the environment. Yes, Todd Linscott is the Friends of Hotberg <laughs> board chair, and Todd, welcome back. Thank you. Nice yes, to be here. Yes, uh, we'll, we'll enjoy in. having you. You always have something really cool to talk about <laughs> going on at the estate. Uh, we know there's beautiful landscaping there at Hotberg. People rave about it, mm -hmm. but uh, people may not realize that there's more that goes into that. There's there's a lot of thought behind the plants that are there on the estate. Yeah, so the, the plant design is by uh, Jens Jensen, and so his whole ethos was using native plants, uh, prairie plants, mm -hmm. uh, plants that uh, were already well adapted to their location. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just in time for Earth Day as well, there's mm -hmm. a number of reasons for that, too. I mean, it's it's just good for the environment. Yes, yeah, so so here we can show you all the, the, the variety of plants you could choose. You could have flowers that bloom from spring to fall, mm -hmm. um, low water usage. Uh, oh, look at that. Feed the bees, fe uh, feed the insects, all that kind of wonderful thing. Yeah. So you host a lot of events throughout the year. We were just talking about the big eclipse event that you had last week. Was a big turnout? Yes, it was about 250 yeah, people. That's amazing. For, wow. <laughs> that would have been a great spot to see. That really yeah. would have been. So you've got uh, another event that you're hoping has a, a big turnout here coming up this weekend. It's coming up this Sunday. That's that free Earth Day event for everyone. Yeah, so that's mostly uh, geared toward families. So okay. we have, uh, uh, ki they can, uh, kids can come and uh, paint pots. They can make seed bombs, wrap uh, all sorts of different prairie seeds into okay. clay and soil you and then take them, them home we have I a couple bombs what yes that was, yeah so they're all filled so the kids can can make their own we'll have the different seeds they can use uh, RC bookworm has sponsored uh, um, um, a children's author uh, Jennifer Paulson who has the uh, the Rachel and Sammy series she's gonna be there to read okay. from 12 to 3 awesome and you just mentioned uh, Jen's Jensen, mm -hmm. yes. Um, basically, the initial architect of all the, the the landscaping there, and you're having a Jens Jensen event coming up in May. Yes, so we we have a, a large uh, native plant sale that we do there with about. Uh, uh, over 100 different species. Okay. Uh, we also will have uh, Jensen Day where we, we give we watch his his uh, documentary and then we walk you through uh, the garden, showing off his kind of ethos and design aspects. That is very very yeah. cool. Um, and the native plant sale. So while this uh, Jensen Day is happening on May 19th, which I believe is also a Sunday, similar to this Earth Day event. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, the spring native plant sale, which we're seeing a photo of right yep. now, um, is both Saturday and Sunday of that yes. weekend. Yes. Um, this has got to be a popular event. For oh yes, they, they start lining up very early. It's <laughs> it's quite funny. <laughs> I can only imagine. And you mentioned the importance of having these native plants. I mean, it's, it's yeah. very good for the environment. They thrive in, in our neck of the woods here in eastern Iowa and western Illinois. So uh, you also offer uh, throughout the year gardening workshops as well. We're, we're working on that. We have uh, a couple volunteers who are doing more to get uh, children's education and sure. then they're trying to do some of the more uh, uh, um, how, to, how to plant natives, how to use some of the, the prairie plants in your yard, and so we're offering more of those. Yeah, that is great because, you know what, more of a reason to get people in the door or just outside the right, door in right. this instance yeah. at the Hauberg Estate because it is such an incredible place. Um, you guys also, we were just talking about the Carriage House, yeah. which is a really cool option for small events and things like that. Um, so this is just a chance for people to come check out what you've got going on there in Rock Island. It's it's really a great spot. It is a beautiful spot, for, especially in the spring. Yeah, yes. <laughs> Everything right. blooming. Yes. Well, let's take a quick look at those upcoming events because we just ran through them. So the yeah. Earth Day celebration is this Sunday, April 21st from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. Um, this is fun for the whole family, so of course include the kids. Uh, the Jens Jensen event, Sunday, May 19th, and the Spring Native Plant Sale is both that Saturday and Sunday, the 18th and 19th. To learn more about programs, events, activities at the Hallberg Estate, visit hallbergestate.org. As always, Todd, yes. thank you so, well, thank much, you so much for being thank here you. and chatting with us. Yes. <laughs>